Hey guys, back again already with another packages video. So we'll start the first one. Uh, just two that I upgraded from DVD, so uh, two movies I upgraded were Charles Play and Day of the Dead, so obviously horror classics, so it was great to have them on uh, Blu-ray finally. Uh, it's the 25th anniversary uh, Chucky edition Blu-ray, so it's pretty cool. Got some uh, audio commentaries and stuff like that, so that's nice. And uh, this is two disc uh, Day of the Dead, uh, released from Umbrella. Pretty nice. Um, actually, did order another uh, Day of the Dead edition as well, but that hasn't got here yet. So, and then I'll go to the next one here. Oh, the pre cut, of course. No cutting, <laughs> no cutting of packages in my videos. Uh, so, Combat Shock. This is one I've heard pretty good things about, and uh, knowing Arrow video, they've uh, it's packed it with special features. Sure, if you can see here, there's disc one and disc two features. <laughs> pretty ridiculous, but the Aaron usually does go pretty much all out on their releases, so you get like a little, um, I guess, kind of a theater art cut, theater poster card or something, and then uh, you get like a little booklet with the, on the film as well. So be nice. They're pretty nice releases. So really getting into buying uh, Arrow video releases. Yeah, the next one's another. Uh, DVD from them, uh, Silent Night, Deadly Night. Really enjoyed this one. Yeah. <laughs> really a uh, decent slasher. I actually hadn't seen any kind of a Christmas themed slashers before this one, so actually really enjoyed this one. So I'll be looking forward to. Um, there's a few more that came out, kind of 70, I think from mid 70s, kind of to 80s. There was another few kind of. Um, kind of Santa slasher movies, so, uh, or Christmas themed slasher movies, so I'll probably uh, be keeping an eye out for those to uh, try to find them as well. Yeah, next package. Uh, uh, so I don't, don't watch too much kind of more modern anime these days, um, but I did see this uh, High School of the Dead, um, it was on TV a couple of years ago and I watched the, uh, pretty much the complete series. I think I didn't see the last episode. So I like the series, um, kind of the last episode, I think, I think they kind of rushed it towards the end of the series though. Felt a little, uh, kind of rushed near the end and, uh, didn't really find the end very satisfying, but, <laughs> final episode and you get kind of a weird, um, OVA disc as well. OVA special is really kind of bizarre <laughs> thing. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what to make of the special OVA DVD disc. It's just really kind of a bizarre take on the uh, series, I think. But <laughs> yeah, I do enjoy the series. Uh, it's pretty much boobs, zombies, <laughs> and yeah, <laughs> that's it. And um, we're on to two sets. So. First one is an arrow video set called the uh, the X Rental set, I guess. Uh, it's in kind of like a, I guess kind of like a VHS kind of style box, style box set. So it's pretty cool. <laughs> so the uh, six films in the box set are Maniac Cop, Cheerleaders, Revenge of the Cheerleaders. Penitentiary 1, Penitentiary 2, and McBain. Uh, so I'll just quickly show the side as well. That way. No. <laughs> and the back. So I've actually only seen Maniac Cop out of this set, so I'm looking forward to checking out the other five movies. Yeah, five movies on here. I believe Cheerleaders and Revenge of the Cheerleaders are kind of like sex potation kind of stuff. Um, not sure about Penitentiary, uh, but I've heard good things about McBain as well, and it's got Christopher Walken, so quite a big fan of his. So, looking forward to checking those out. 
And another box set, also from Arrow Video. Because uh, you guys know I've been going a little bit crazy with my Arrow Video stuff lately. Uh, it's this fantastic factory. Um, kind of a weird, kind of, I don't know, almost like a mini shoebox kind of box. So I'm going to pull it out. Let's see, I'll back in the box. Films inside. So uh, you got uh, Beyond Reanimator, Fast, Love of the Damned, Fast, uh, Romana, Sun, um, Santia, the, the Werewolf Hunt. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. <laughs> and uh, Arachnid, so pretty cool. Um, I only watched Arachnid so far in this set, but didn't find that too bad. Giant spiders. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. And then it kind of uh, just goes back in like that. So pretty, cool, pretty uh, interesting kind of. Um, what is it like? Kind of, uh, how the set's made, kind of very interesting. <laughs> and then, uh, finally, uh, do have some video games in this update as well. I've got kind of this weird, um, just, just a bit of cardboard, really. Cardboard. <laughs> Not really a proper package. There, so grab a few things. Heavy um, games are having kind of a uh, online sale, so I'll grab a few things, uh, grab Untold Legends uh, for the PSP, it's because it was a, uh, a Western RPG for the PSP, I believe I paid, I paid uh, six, uh, four dollars, so yeah, I can't go wrong for four bucks. Uh, next one I picked up was Super Monkey Ball Touch and Roll, uh, sadly it is missing its uh, insert here, but uh, this is an older style case with the GBA slot, so I might end up uh, just putting a GBA game in here instead. Uh, mainly got this because I don't want to open the uh, sealed copy I already have. And then the last one I grabbed uh, was Orcs and Elves, which is kind of like a, uh, I guess you'd say, like a first person dungeon crawler game. So it's pretty interesting so far. Um, it was nine dollars. Uh, sucks that uh, both the DS games I ordered were sent out in these kind of generic -y insert with the generic inserts, not the original ones. That's a bit annoying, but uh, and I might just end up printing them out anyway from the coverproject.net because they got they got a whole bunch. So yeah, and that's pretty much everything for this video. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.